Plymouth County School Board wants to begin construction at three old schools, but it's hitting a roadblock. That's because members of the Board of Supervisors say they're not convinced it's a good idea to invest. WSLS 10's Bethany Teak explains where the two sides stand. Some individuals are very content with the building as long as you go in and lights come on. The condition of three Wythe County schools and what to do about it is sparking disagreement between the superintendent and some Board of Supervisors members. All the schools are not near as bad as we're saying to this group. School Superintendent Jeff Perry is asking the board for about $60 million for new construction and renovations to Spiller Elementary School, Scott Memorial Middle School, and George Wythe High School. We've had to install temporary air conditioning units that are extremely loud at times. Our heating situation is sporadic at best. Scott Memorial School, for example, the whole slab underneath the building is moving. The board says there is no money in the budget for capital improvements this year and that it could begin discussing the plan next year. But with state funding cuts, there are no guarantees. This snowball has to stop somewhere and to take on a new responsibility Facing that snowball is not the time that I'm willing to go along with. The planned presentation and back and forth discussion lasted for nearly an hour. Perry concluded by telling board members that many students are using old surplus furniture in their classrooms, a contrast to the boardroom conditions. This is a facility for you and it's extremely comfortable. The lighting is well, the heating, the air is well, furniture is great. Perry says he is hopeful the board will approve a plan next year. The board says it will begin looking at next year's budget in January. In Withful, Bethany T, WSLS 10.